This is the TV news for Wednesday, December 15th. And let's begin with our regular Wednesday feature, The Programming Pulse. Now standing by, with all of the Golden Globe nominations in the major TV show categories, is Susan Hibben. Susan. Well, thank you, Jeffrey. Here are the nominees for the 2011 Golden Globes in the three major TV categories. For Best Television Drama Series, Boardwalk Empire, Dexter, The Good Wife, Mad Men, and The Walking Dead. For Best Comedy or Musical Television Series, 30 Rock, The Big Bang Theory, The Big C, Glee, Modern Family, and Nurse Jackie. And finally, for Best TV Miniseries or Motion Picture, Carlos, The Pacific, Pillars of the Earth, Temple Grandin, and You Don't Know Jack. Now, note that cable TV came in with a lion's share of the nominations and no TV network broadcast cable or otherwise topped Showtime, which grabbed eight Golden Globe nominations. The Golden Globe Awards will air on Sunday, January 16th on NBC, and of course you can catch all of the results in the TV categories here at the TVnews.tv. I'm Susan Hibben, and I'll see you next week here on The Programming Pulse. The Programming Pulse is brought to you by Way Out There. Now's your chance to get the Tonight Show of the Paranormal. That's Way Out There. Hey, remember when astronaut Dave engaged a certain renegade computer in a battle of wits in 2001, a space odyssey? Roll that clip, will you please, Hal? I'm sorry, Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. Hal, will you please roll the clip? I'm sorry, Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. Fine. Well, it's man versus computer once again next February on Jeopardy when Uber winners Ken Jennings and Brad Rutter go up against IBM's new supercomputer named Watson. It's the best two out of three. There's a million bucks up for grabs and of course, loser leaves town. Okay, let's go on to the next segment, Hal. I'm sorry, Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. Typical. This TV News exclusive is brought to you by Sando Communications. Sound judgment, solid credibility, and superior results. This is Sando Communications. And now we proudly present our next installment of the top 25 TV show opens of all time. Well, coming in at number 12. Yeah, that's perhaps the most well-known nine notes in human history. And more than 40 years after this TV show went off of the air, it remains a part of the American social fabric. It can only be the open for Dragnet. Hey, um, how about a, a bonus with that memorable, you know, Mark 7 limited clothes? Thanks. And we'll continue to count them down. The top 25 TV show opens of all time tomorrow, as well as all December long, here at the TVnews.tv. events and opportunities brought to you by dude walker get the best voice get the best price get dude at dudewalker.com and the first word is duh yep the second annual duh award celebrating the dumbest most undecided and most heralded tv happenings of 2010 come your way available december 28th here at the tv news.tv nominations are already out 
and you can see them in the tvnews.tv archives in our, well, oh so lame special, Countdown to Duh. And don't forget, you get to choose the Duh Award winners by voting on Facebook at the tvnews.tv fan page. If you want your message to reach top TV and new media execs, psst, headed toward 250,000 views, then become a sponsor of the TV News. Get in the game by shooting us an email at advertise at the tvnews.tv. And that about does it for this edition of the TV News. Tomorrow, another fresh edition featuring the PR scription with Arthur Sandow, and he'll be taking an updated look at Piers Morgan's PR image. I'm Jeff Grimshaw. Thanks for watching, and go out and make it a good day. The TV News has been brought to you by American Ingenuity TV. For all of your electronic marketing and creative challenges, American Ingenuity TV is simply the solution.